What's going on guys? It's Coach Christian over here from Six Pack Abs. And today, I'm gonna be showing y'all a video how we're gonna attack the calves. Most people, they either have an issue with working the calves, whether it be, you know, how to lift, what exercises to do, the frequency, the rep ranges, you know, whole lot of things. But simple, the way we're gonna put it is basically what we're trying to do to work these calves, the function is to bring the heel upward, just like this. So I'm gonna show you guys some exercises that are real simple that we can do at home. Uh, all you're really gonna need is a set of dumbbells, maybe a piece of plywood, so that way we can put under the balls of our feet to get a good stretch. So that way, what we're doing is we're getting not only an eccentric, but a concentric portion on the way up. So stretch and then power on the way up. So all you're really gonna need, like I said, the dumbbells, the plywood, and then maybe a kitchen counter to hold on to. All right, guys. First exercise for our calf attack here. We're gonna do a single leg variation here. So I'm gonna hold the dumbbell in the hand that I'm gonna do the calf race, you know, same arm, same leg. Now let's imagine this is a kitchen counter or maybe a tall stool or something to hold on to. That'll just give you a little bit of balance. And what we're gonna do here is almost a variation. Like if you've seen people do the donkey calf races at, at the machine, you know, at the machine, using the machine at the gym, all we're gonna do here is start off, we want our knee fully flexed. Now, when we come up, we're gonna come up on the balls of our feet, keep the knee flexed, slowly come down on the way up, fast. Slowly come down, up, that's three, up, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and 10 and we're gonna switch if it's a little bit difficult for you guys to do you can always just drop the dumbbell go body weight and then also if that's still a little bit too hard what we can do is just take the plywood out and focus on the explosion upwards so doing the same thing here five stretch on the way down up six seven, eight, nine, and 10. Now we're coming over here, exercise two. I'm gonna grab our second dumbbell here. We're gonna get into a squat jump, primarily using the calves at the top of the movement. So I'm gonna squat here and explode up. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Drop those dumbbells. We're gonna get about 20 to 30 seconds rest. Then we're gonna go into two more sets. This is a great way to not only add some frequency, add some volume, also make sure that we're adding size, you know, over time. So wanna make sure that we get the rep range in that's comfortable for you guys but to also make sure that we're still putting the muscles to good use, really working those muscles, that way we can help them grow. So the reason why we're doing the slow pace and then of course the fast pace exercise is to really work the slow and the fast twitch muscle fibers that we have in our calves. They're meant to help us walk around all day, but also like we just saw, explode doing explode so fast and then the slow kinds of movements that we're trying to work so let's go ahead and grab one dumbbell we're going to go back into our single leg donkey calf raise right here grab your kitchen counter up two three four five six seven eight let's get that good stretch and explode nine good stretch and explode ten next side one 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, guys, let's work those fast twitch muscle fibers in the calves. Let's come over here. Let's get that squat jump with the explosive calf raise. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, guys, rest it out. Now, some other variations you can do when doing these calves, you know, maybe not so much with the jump squats, but with stationary exercises like the ones we're doing here, the donkey calf raises, you can work on the angling of the foot. That way we can work not only the outside of your gastrocnemius, the outside of your calf, we'll work the inside as well. So turn your feet inward like this. We're gonna be working out the outsides. Turn your foot and your knee outward just like this. You start working the insides. So. Right now we're kind of working a bit of everything. We're gonna mix it up and I'm gonna show you the variations here and here, five reps each, here and here, five reps each, and then our last set of the jump squats. Let's grab that dumbbell. All right, same ham, same leg. Let's go ahead and let's start with the inside. One, two, same stretch on the way down, three, Four and five. Oh, let's, let's do that again. Four and five. Turn your foot outward. One, two, three. Still getting that good stretch. Power on the way up. Four. Last one. Five. Let's switch hands. Starting with the inside. One two, three, four, and five. Let's turn that foot outward. And one, two, three, four, and five. Calves should be feeling a little bit swollen right about now in a good way. Let's get those 10. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, guys, so we're done with calves. If y'all have any other questions about the exercises we did today or some other body parts that y'all are looking to exercise, stretch, you know, things like that feel free to message the coaches here at Six Pack Abs. We got your back.